thought you that was some random guy in chat the whole time. That oh thought had, my. That had Jelani's name. No. This whole time that was him? Wow. This That's on his Twitter. That's dude, his Twitter I just, handle. I've seen that in chat for like years now. And I'm I thought that was just some random guy that like had Jump Jelani's, name. Yeah, he had Jump Steady's Twitter handle. Dude, I can't believe that was actually him this whole time. Oh my god. That's hilarious. Alright, now you know what fan you know what's right? You sound like an O five person right now. What does that yeah. mean? <laughs> what the heck is it O five? That's how much loss that's zero wins, five losses. That's what it is. Alright, you got it. Anyway, let's see if Nitro can upset Master today. We already yeah. kinda saw how bad this match can be for Joker when Leo got three would by Prodigy and two stock multiple games. Yeah. Mario just has really good combos on Joker, honestly. That's basically what his advantage yeah, is. Yeah, his ability to have those combos over Joker, even when Joker gets our send, that means he's able to wipe out our send a lot faster. A much more consistent way, too, than having to get, like, uh, one-off hits. Oh, that meter just... Um, this is the first time I've really, really paid attention to it, uh, other than Frostbite, but that meter goes by so quick now. Oh, oh, you really got hit by that. Wow. See, this is one thing that I feel like I hope Master goes back and he watches this this water, but I feel like <laughs> the one All thing right. that Master sometimes struggles in at times is the neutral game. Like I feel like he his mindset just becomes like I want to get in and get the hit and bring it back, but sometimes if Master will just reel himself back, look for a couple of neutral hits, play the footsies and fundamentals, like he'd be a little bit more off, especially in that situation that played out. I see because he's going for fireball and he's going for an aerial approach here. He's sacrificing his ability to go ahead and neutral right and then go ahead and play foot the footsie game. But I understand Master's mindset. Like, his ability to just understand, like, once I get in, I do get the hit and the percents and the combos. Yeah, it's kind of hard to tell Mario player not to, like, fish for the grab and, like, you know, the combo stars and stuff. But kind of why Dark Wizzy's so good because he's just really good at just playing neutral. Yeah. But it also what separates, like, it sounds really funny, and not to take anything away from Dark Wizzy, but, like, it does really separate a lot of players in terms of skills and strategies, because, like, also the ability to play a neutral when your opponent has, like, things like Arsene, it oh. definitely benefits a lot, because, like, if if the fact that Master Mario should have seen, like, okay, he's got Arsene, the first thing he does come out of back is back air, so my ability to just try to play and fight back for center stage involves me trying to play footsies in neutral, and because Master, like you said, he's going to go for a back air, he sacrificed so much for for one big play, and unfortunately that backfired, and that puts my Nitro still on a lead. Oh, got the dunk dash, but now he's off stage. Uh, that was oh, good. That was wow. good. That was a good drift from Nitro. He got past it down and got a hitbox out. That's pretty smart. Oh, oh wow. yep. Problem slipping. He thought he was safe after the prison chain, but he was not. Nice oh, drag down. Nice drag down. Fair one. Yeah, Nitro has those confirms too. You can't sleep on this guy. Ooh, there. Arsene has been literally activated at this moment, yeah. Oh, oh he it. missed the upbeat. Oh, wow, that's a good drift. But he still gets back at first troubles. Nice, no, still able to recover. Oh, oh no, he's good, he's good, he's good, he's good. He has to wait for it. Stage? Yep. Yeah. So in that situation there, I felt like Master Mara really wanted to avoid getting hit by Arsene's back air, which anybody would in their right mindset. I feel like the one thing that would have changed it a little bit if he had directional air dodge upwards instead of neutral directional air dodge, but I also respect the neutral air dodge because you have less end light off of that and you can act faster. I'm pretty sure he hit him out of his jumps with the guns. Yeah, that too. Like, he hit him out of the jump with the gun, forced the up B, and he immediately countered it. Like, I'm pretty sure he was just dead no matter what he did there. I see Leo do that a lot. He literally just shoots them out of the jumps with the gun and, like, immediately counter. It's actually so good. Oh, Arsene's activated, and he's got 87 onto Nitro. Every time Master loses... such a big sacrifice. Every time Master loses, he switches to Dark Mario and, like, does way better. You know why? As then use color. I feel like it's a, it's it's like a mindset thing. Oh, it's not out of shield. Finally see someone punish that down there out of shield. A lot of times I see Jokers just, like, jump on top of people's shield with down there all day with Arsene. I feel like a lot of people get scared of it, too, because they know what it confirms into, so they're like, ah, oh, if I don't punish it, you know what? I'm taking an L there. Be punished, yeah. No Rebel Scar for you. Oh my goodness. He's gotten like Arsene twice out of getting hit. No. See, oh, hold on. Look, see how much better that situation worked out for him? 
He legitimately did not go for a fireball, did not run him and go for an attack, didn't mash anything. And all his ability was in his Dude, movement, and he avoided. He got destroyed there. Yeah, he got destroyed there. But, like, earlier when he came back from the stage, he was able to find himself for center stage. That's a better play. I mean, you may have lost a stock, but that was way better than losing it earlier, 10 seconds earlier. He bought him literally oh. 10 seconds more on life. Okay, he's. I, I think at this point, Master Mario should be looking to play a little bit more on reaction. Trying to see how Nitro would come out from the stage. But he gets the forward smash. Puts Nitro off. off. No smash? No, he, I feel like that's what he's looking for, <laughs> but missed the mark. Yeah, Nitro's been hanging on the ledge a really long time at high percent. I'm surprised Master just doesn't down tilt back here. Yeah. But I also have to respect him too because the way he's kind of spacing himself at the ledge, he's looking for like one of the five ab options to pick when you get out of the ledge. Nice. Oh, that was way better than down tilt back air. What the heck? I've never seen them do that before. That's so good. I don't even know if that's guaranteed or not, but I definitely don't think Nitro was prepared to air dodge there. Nope, but definitely one thing that someone has to be prepared for is R sand now with it being activated here. Oh, nice. Save that jump to get out of it. I kind of want to see Mario's use more Flood against Joker, too, because it also pushes Joker away and gives you a little bit more time to fight against Arsene mm. if you're trying to time it out. Oh, oh he my yeah. God, I respect dude. it, too, because he kind of was scared of going high because of Arsene back air, but nonetheless, Nitro will catch that. Yeah, he went so deep for that back air. Yeah, Fortunately, he, Arsene's gone now, so he's going to have to play a little bit of an honest stock before he can get Arsene back. Yeah, within, like, two Mario combos... Maybe, yeah, within two Mario combos, Arsene will definitely be back. Oh, yeah, he's good. He's good. Oh, almost oh, that was the shield poke. Oh, my God. That he could have swung up Smash again if you want to. Literally within two hits, Arsene comes back. Master has to finish it here. Back throw will definitely do it. And game number two. Go ahead, Master Mario. What a win a piece. Yeah, that was really close. Inspired the percent deficit. It really felt like Nitro could have brought that back. Yeah. Nonetheless, Master played it pretty clean. Like, he kind of knew, okay, Arsene's coming back. I can't literally toy around with my with Nitro anymore. I have to take care of the stock here. Or I risk the comeback factor. Or so I would like to call it X Factor. <laughs> you don't, you don't want to play against X Factor. Sparking Arsene. Yeah, it's annoying, especially when he has rage. Like, you can just die it off stage to, like, two or three backers. Not even two, not even three, like, two backers. Yeah. No joke. It's also, like... Can I honestly say this? The one thing about Joker that makes him really cool is all of the sounds that he makes from all of his hits sound really, really nice. And then you have Byleth, who hits you with forward, and it sounds like a pool, you got hit by a pool noodle. Yeah, I don't know what they're thinking with yeah, the sound design on that, but... It was really bad, in my opinion. Like, they need to, they need to buff that. Well, this doesn't feel satisfying. It doesn't. Really. Like, Joker oh. back air? That sounds satisfying as hell. I mean, it hits like a truck. It sounds like a truck hit you. Nice pummel to the back throw. Definitely got rid of a lot of meter here. Now to 114. Meter is literally gone with Massamaro making such wow. a play. Punished him for going for the grab. You know, Mass has got the movement here. I like a little bit of a wave bound. I'm sorry, uh, a little wave landing that we saw earlier. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what Nigel can do to get this stock off. Finally sends him off stage, but the drift with the fireball assist to getting to ledge really easily there for Massamaro. Oh, man. Yeah, Nigel's looking for the killing blow. It might, uh, Master's playing so safe, pretty much. Oh, he gets yeah. it, yeah. There we go. Fair one, up air, drag down, down smash. Classic joke combo. Yep. But, and, oh, good. He wow. baits out the Rebel's Guard. Nonetheless, though, he's got Arsene activated. Going to take him off the top? No, he's good. Yeah. Still, that's a lot of percent. Yeah, they, and they meter. They drain the, the meter really well, too. I feel like that's what Mario does really good against Joker. Like I said, like consistent combos to actually, like, not only do they bring out Arsene, but they also, like, have a consistent way of getting rid of the two as well. I need to do more percent. Gonna go for the fourth throw, obviously, to get him off the stage. That's what I want to see a little bit more flood. Keep Joker away. Oh, call the air dodge in. All right. Uh, watch oh. yourself, Master. Yeah, use that roll to come back more sword center. Yeah, Nitro wasn't prepared to cover it either. Oh, man. Fourth throw? Oh, mix up with the down throw. I like the change up here, and he stops himself to see the Rebel's Guard. Oh, but the roll gets caught. Like, he, he was neutral from ledge pretty much 
every time. And the one time you mix up with the roll, Master already let her punch him with the up smash. Okay. So that's an opportunity here, though. Oh, nice. Oh, he's overshot the ledge. Nitro wasn't ready for that. If he was, it could have been an easy force smash. Yeah, I hope Nitro is ready for the arson he might potentially get here on this last dock. Hopefully he can put it into good use here. Putting in Master at a 105. I mean, the best way that <laughs> Nitro would actually honestly want this is like he gets rid of the stock, right? He's got a little bit more over half meter than over Arsene, right? I mean, he can bring that back. Yeah, he wants to get this stock without Arsene, honestly. Mm -hmm. And he just save for the last one. Well, fortunately, oh. though, he's got to use it now. Yeah. Still alive here. Oh, that's my safety going to the other corner of the stage. Oh, but that rogue dash attack that just gets so many people from Joker. It's kind of fast. Decent burst option from Joker. A lot of characters don't have something like that that can kill. Yeah. But Good for Massa, too, to wait on the Angel platform. Bought himself, like, a, I want to say, like at least two seconds off of our centimeter. And then brought him to the situation here. Of course, if Nitro can hold the great DI, he still has a chance at one more Arsene. Especially to bring things back here. 97%. He's got to watch out how he's DIing, too. Oh, man. This is so scary for both players, but mainly Nitro right now. Oh, nice. Oh, drag down from the down? guns. That was really clean. Oh, oh no. Dude. It'd be a lot, like that. A lot of people there, they do a defensive option after taking in place, but like Master just swung the forward smash. I think that Nitro got caught off guard too because he saw the tech and he's like, okay, I'm going to wait for him to like not press anything here, see what he does after the tech, and then like try to get a follow up. But yeah. Yeah, Master's like, nope. Immediately going to go for the forward smash. It's rough too because he was making a comeback, and like that's all he needed was like a few more tech chases. Set up like a throw off stage, go for like an off stage back air. But uh, yeah, Master's a little bit too clutch. Oh, and we're back on PS2. A lot of people do not think you should ever counter pick Mario to this stage. I'm kind of kind of one of them, honestly. Especially Master's Mario, like, he's so comfortable on the stage. But let's see, let's see what the adjustments are here from Nitro. Definitely show that he has the potential to take uh, this set. Yeah, gets an upper. 76% here. Master Mario using that jump to try to fight himself back towards center stage. Couple changes that I am noticing from my show. He's kind of playing a little bit more aggressive rather than giving Master Mario a little bit more time. Yeah, I mean, at this point, you have to like change up your style a little bit since you know you're down. And you're potentially one game away from the since the bracket. But yeah, especially since it's been so close between them, really. Mm -hmm. Marcin, yep. Uh, oh, Master man, has to finish off extension. here. Yep. Oh my goodness, this is why you don't like sending Mario on this stage. He's got so much more up there just due to the platform layout. Yeah, and even in general, too, the meta being with so many platforms, only one stage, technically not having platforms. Uh, honestly, this is something that definitely Master Mario could have benefited off. I don't know if they definitely, I don't know, sometimes I see too many people gentlemen pick the PS2, but you got to really consider what, what your opponent might be thinking in that situation too as well. Always well, got pretty much Arsene activated. I like the fact that Nitro understands that too. Buying some time for percents, trying to mix up the take aim with the back airs as well. Good use oh, of Makara cards. Yeah, Nitro is spacing it incredible right here. Master just can't get in on this guy's hitboxes right now. Oh, wow. Ooh. See, I don't know about that jab, but he does not get punished for it. Yeah. Okay. Spacing again. Max range. F2. Oh, my God. Everything is working out for Nitro on this Arsen stock. Oh, Tetra yep. Karn. Perfectly timed with just a sliver of meter left on the Arsen gauge. That was amazing play from Nitro. That was a really good out of shield play from Nitro, too, as well. I think the one thing that Master also has to cool things down to as well is when he comes back on stage, he tries to a little, I wouldn't say he tries to aggressively, but sometimes it's better to reset yourself at the ledge simply because like, you know, you might get hit by a jab or a combo. And it seems that like Nitro's definitely much readier for Masamaru than Masamaru's ready for Nitro on the return. Okay, good use of angled shield there. I wanted to see if he could get a punish. Oh man, so close. Yeah, Nitro's again spacing right outside of mid range where Mario just doesn't have the hitbox to contest without doing anything unsafe. Like, see, Master Mario is holding forward a lot more, trying to get these 
Uh, moves to connect, but okay. Nice, he wanted the DI mix up and he oh. waited to get the net at the last second, but unfortunately Rebel's Guard still activated. I'm surprised Master still swung on him while he's charging the, the Rebel's Cage, but he does get the up smash. I think he messed up the gun dash from ledge. Yeah. And uh, Master was able to punish. Now this is not a lead, really. It's like one grab from Master Mario. I think Nitro recognized that. That's why he's like just trying to stay off the ground as long as possible. Okay. Nice. 99% here. Oh, Master, I'm telling you, Matt, look at the percent that Master took from just Wait. trying to land so aggressively on the stage here. No aerials, of course, but he really wanted to take center stage. But I respect it, too. Being at the ledge against Joker at times, you're just one whiff punish, one back air away from mm. literally losing a stock at 123. Yeah, good. All right. He's also a threat of losing a stock really early, too. Master's combos are disgusting, man. Oh, stage, yep. The dare out Our son. Our son here. Oh, Does he get it? Does he get it now? Kill, but that's so much percent. He has him at the ledge where he wants him, though. Even games, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, nice. Mix up. Oh, okay. nice DI from Nacho. Knowing that he's going to go for the down, they're not going to DI in, but that meter is slowly to Oh, use the flood. Use the flood, man. Keep yeah. that Joker away with oh, Arsene, and he gets the scoop up. Back here, Master what Mario with a the play. pop off. 